All right, guys, we have a review here. I'm going to do a little review of the Nexus 7 with the new update. So um, let's kind of get into it. This is the first thing. This is uh, Android Jelly Bean 4.2 and on the Nexus 7, like I said. So the first thing we got here is widgets. We have kind of a scrollable widgets on our lock screen. There's some email. You can add another widget here. Um, let's say calendar just for sake there we go so you have some scrollable widgets on your lock screen which is really nice you can kind of access those things really quickly doing that and then the other thing that's new on uh, 4.2 is this down here this is um, my user and this is when my kids want to use it they click that button so if you can see if we change users now it goes to my kids setup their user interface so this is mine, we'll go back to mine, and we'll unlock it. So as you can see here, it's pretty much the same, um, pretty much the same looking interface here. Uh, the newest things that we have with um, Jelly Bean 4.2 are these. Clock has changed, so we now have your uh, stopwatch there, timer thing here. Um, that you can use in your clock app. So other than that, your gallery um, has now changed a little bit. I don't really have very many pictures in here. Yeah, like just two. But um, your gallery is a little bit of a different look to it. You have some settings right here. You can edit some stuff and crop and pinch or whatever. So it is a newer gallery. Uh, if you have a device that has camera, the Nexus 7 does not. I mean, it has a camera on the front, but it's not set up for taking pictures. Then you'll have the Photosphere um, feature, which you can see in some of my other videos, which is really, really cool. Very, very nice. So this is all very, very smooth. I like this, uh, just like any Jelly Bean, pretty much. Um, app drawer is the same, same kind of look there. Um, the new thing here is your pull down so this is your pull down with notifications and this side is your pull down with toggles so you got your battery in one percent increments which is really really sweet for this uh, stock setup here um, enter settings brightness rotation wi-fi airplane mode bluetooth and also it shows you your user right there in the top so you can go into settings here and we can scroll down here and hit tablet and now we can see we are on Android 4.2 and if we hold that down we got our little jelly bean Easter egg here and now you can flick off your little jelly bean guys so pretty neat also if you want to get into development settings just so you guys see this um, right here it says develop developer options which is where you turn on USB debugging if you want to get into this and um, it's not there normally so what you gotta do is you go into tablet and then I think it's build number I don't remember but you just start tapping on it so right here no need you are already a developer so you just keep tapping on build number and then when you go back your developer options will show up which is where you turn on your USB debugging right here so that's not normally in there. You won't be able to see that until you go into tablet and you tap on the build number. Then it'll make you a developer and you can get to those options now. Um, so there's right there, here's your users. And again, here you can see you can add another user up here on top. You can see me, my kids mode. So the reason I like the kids mode is, I'll show you. In kids mode, or I just call it kids mode, it's just a different user interface. Um, you know, you can just set things up so that uh, it's got all their little games on it, Netflix forum, just stuff for them to be able to use, and it won't mess up all of your features that you have set up. Uh, so I like that too. I also even put it under a different Gmail account because my Gmail account has a credit card hooked up, and I've had them buy apps on me and stuff like that, and it kind of pissed me off. So uh, if I got them under a Gmail account that doesn't have a credit card attached, they can't just go in here and start buying stuff in the uh, G Google Play. So um, definitely like this feature for another user on the tablet, which is quite nice. Um, and then we'll turn it off, and we'll come back on. Go back to me. And now we're back.
So really easy to turn uh, between there. Very, very, very simple. Um, you can root this with uh, Wiggy's root toolkit, which I have videos about on how to do it and install custom recovery and all that kind of stuff. I haven't really seen any custom rounds for this thing yet, um, but I'm sure they will be coming. Um, but yeah, definitely, uh, I like it. I like I like the different pull downs. I kind of wish these were like almost in one instead of being in two different spots, but uh, still pretty nice. Uh, you do have the rotation here, and you can rotate. So, and then if you pull down this side, notifications, and this side is your toggles. I'm really glad they put the toggles in here. That's one of the things I always love about custom rounds is the toggles. And now it's right here in stock. So Google is uh, seeing some good improvements here, definitely. Um, speed looks really good on it. I haven't done a quadrant on it yet. I'm sure I will just to kind of see what we got. But there it is, guys. That is uh, Nexus 7 with uh, Android 4.2. Um, all, most of the new features I can show you in there. Oh yes, also new feature is let's go to let's go to a mail. Let's just say I'm going to reply to something here, just so I can do it, and then compose. So the new keyboard is like this. See, it has swipe, so you can uh, see it kind of floating over my finger. The word. And it keeps kind of changing, trying to figure out what I'm trying to say. Um, so this swipe keyboard makes it super easy to type really, really fast, um, which is just really nice. Uh, I really like it a lot, and it's really easy to use. So there you go. That's another new feature in there. Just wanted to show it to you. I'm going to get rid of this sucker. I don't want to send this to nobody. And back out. So there it is. That is it. Nexus 7 running the newest jelly bean build of 4.2. Hope you guys like this little review. Please give me a thumbs up if you did. And we will catch you guys next time. Stay tuned. I'm sure i got more videos coming this week. And uh, hope you guys enjoy them.